think the most important thing was that we acted swiftly yesterday. Um, Louis issued his apology um, and then we spoke with him last night uh, and again this morning and um, we've taken action to find Louis for his actions and Brendan's spoken to him, I've spoken to him um, and Brendan will be working with him further on his discipline. Uh, you can see you know, when you speak to him how, how sorry he is about it and you know, he's certainly shown quite a lot of contrition to us. Um, and as part of that, he's also asked um, that we donate the fine to the Hillsborough Family Support Group. Um, I think he felt like he let a lot of people down yesterday. And, um, you know, we'll, we'll work with Louis, as I say, uh, Brendan particularly, um, on this side of his sort of character, if you like, in his game. But, um, you know, I think hopefully that puts the matter to rest from our point of view. Um, and then we'll wait and see if there's any further action from, from the football authorities. Not at all, you know, I think, uh, it affects his future in the sense that we have to work with him on his discipline but you know Louis is a, a very important player to the club um, he's a very popular player with his teammates um, as we keep saying he signed a new four-year contract last summer and you know we'd all love to see him here throughout that contract um, he's a fantastic player top scorer um, everything we'd want in a striker so so no change there I think um, this is more about you know, getting him back on the right track and, and as I say, that's largely down to Brendan now to work with him on that side of his character.